टूडे आवर डिसकसिंग टपिक इज अबाउट सीमेंट्स मेक टू टोटी के भि सार्किट ब्रेकार रेटेड भोल्टेज इज टू फोर्टी फाइव के भि एंड दिस इज द टोटाल पिक्चोरियल रिप्रेजेंटेशन अब टू टोटी के भि सार्किट ब्रेकार एंड दिस इज द थ्री ए पी वन एफ वन टाइप सार्किट ब्रेकार द इलेक्ट्रिकल डेटा इज गिभन टू द इन्स्ट्रक्शन बुक इज रेटेड भोल्टेज इज टू फोर्टी फाइव के भि फ्रिकुएन्सि फिफ्टी हार्च रेटेड नर्माल कारेंट फोर थाउजेंड एमपियार रेटेड शर्ट सार्किट ब्रेकिंग कारेंट फिफ्टी किलो एमपियार रेटेड लाइन चार्जिंग ब्रेकिंग कारेंट वन टोटी फाइव एमपियार एंड मेजारिंग केबिल ब्रेकिंग कारेंट टू फिफ्टी एमपियार एंड रेटेड शर्ट सार्किट मेकिंग कारेंट वन टू फाइव किलो एमपियार पिक रेटेड शर्ट सार्किट ड्यूरेशन इज थ्री सेकेंड एंड रेटेड अपारेटिंग सिकुएन्स ओपेन डैश जिरो पॉइंट थ्री सेकेंड क्लोज ओपेन थ्री मिनिट क्लोज ओपेन मिनिमाम कमैंड ड्यूरेशन एट्टी मिली सेकेंड मिनिमाम कमैंड ड्यूरेशन ओपेंग कमैंड एट्टी मिली सेकेंड क्लोजिंग टाइम सिक्सटी टू मिली सेकेंड प्लस माइनस सिक्स मिली सेकेंड ओपेंग टाइम थार्टी सेवेन मिली सेकेंड प्लस माइनस फोर मिली सेकेंड आर्किंग टाइम लेस ग्रेटर दैन टोटी फाइव मिली सेकेंड ब्रेकिंग टाइम लेस दैन सिक्सटी मिली सेकेंड एंड क्लोज ओपेन टाइम सिक्सटी मिली सेकेंड प्लस माइनस टेन मिली सेकेंड एंड डेट टाइम इज थ्री हंड्रेड मिली सेकेंड दिस इज द इंटरनल पिक्चर्स इन साइड द इंटरप्टर ऑफ द पोल्स दिस इज द डाइम मेकानिजिम पिक्चर्स इन फ्रंट एंड दिस इज द बैकवर्ड पिक्चर्स फॉर द कंट्रोल सर्किट वायरिंग दिस इज द डेंसिटी मोनिटर डब्ल्यू वन इज गिवेन टू द पॉइंट of the filling flange this is the total ga drawing of the 220 kb circuit breaker this g as per this general arrangement drawing the circuit breaker will be erected if it is on the foundation or if uh, you are replacing the old breaker for the problem you have to retrofit it the position for the structures and then after uh, retrofittings of the structures you can climb the poles and adjust accordingly as per the given instructions this is the nameplate of the siemens make 245 kv circuit breaker now discussed about the various instructions and various points given here here k10 k11 k12 k77 61 k75 er la k75 er lb k75 er lc k16 f16 k22 e1 e14 f22 f23 f24 k9 la k9 lb k9 lc and k88 different types of mcb and the contactors are present here b1 h0 h1 h2 s21 22 s13 s14 s15 and these are the counter p1 la p1 lb p1 lc and these are the channels la for the red phase lb for the yellow phase and lc for the blue phase connections and these are this r2 r2 is given here for the space heater this is the space heater now we are discussing about what is it r2 is the space heater b1 b1 is the thermostat k10 and k14 is the auxiliary contactors for general lockout k25 la lb lc auxiliary contactor for anti pumping k12 k22 auxiliary contactor for dc supply 1 and 2 k11 auxiliary contactor for trip synchronizing k16 on delay timer enforced triple pole operation k77 k88 auxiliary contactor for manual trip 
के सिक्सटी वन अक्सिलरि कन्टैक्टर फर ट्रिप सार्किट एस टोटी वन टोटी टू इज दा ओपेन ग्रीन क्लोज पुश बाटन एस फोरटीन एंड एस फिफ्टीन एस फोरटीन एस फिफ्टीन इज द रोटारी सूच फर डि सी सप्लाई वन एंड टू एफ टोटी टू टोटी थ्री टोटी फोर सिंगल पोल प्लस निउट्रल एम सी वि ए सी सप्लाई एफ सिक्सटीन इज द एम सी वि फर द स्प्रिंग चार्जिंग मोटर एफ टोटी वन ऑन अफ सूच फर इलुमिनेशन एच जिरो एच वन एच टू अफ ग्रीन ऑन रेड एंड स्प्रिंग चार्ज ब्लू चार्जिंग इंडिकेशन लैम्प एस थार्टीन इज द लोकल एंड रिमोट सूच एक्स टोटी इज द इंडस्ट्रियल टाइप प्लाग सकेट उथ सूच यू वन इज द पैनल लैम्प पी वन एल ए पी वन एल वि पी वन एल सी इज द अपारेशनल काउंटार इलेक्ट्रिकल एल ए एल वि एल सी इज द टार्मिनल फर द इंटरपोल वायरिंग एंड के नाइन एल ए एल वि एल सी इज द अक्सिलरि कन्टैक्टर फर द मोटर दिस इज द अपारेटिंग मेकानिजिम कम्पार्टमेंट पोल एल ए एल वि एल सी This is the connecting diagram in between the mechanism box and the three operating mechanisms pole. Pole LA for the red phase, LB for the white phase, and LC for the blue phase connections. In these pictures, you can identify the different switches, different contactors, and different terminals are being used for the control circuit wiring. and for the control purpose all are the given in this pages now we are starting about the closing circuit discussions this is the dc2 this is the dc1 circuit the positive and b and b1 are the negative of the dc1 and dc2 as the 220 kb breaker has the three pole separate individual poles are present and simultaneously you have to close the three pole in the single time and in the case of the tripping also you have to operate accordingly so in that case first when you are uh, this is the push button switch here the on and here the off switch is present if you are on, you are press um, the button then the dc is flowing through this point and this k10 uh, is a conductor this k10 is conductor uh, is energized when the three pole gas pressures is sufficient as per the instructions of the manual or as per the standard then k10 will be energized then k10 will be energized so this no contact will be nc and k14 is also the um, uh, contactor for the dc2 that will be obviously energized and this energized contact will be go through this this is the normally close contact so the voltage will come to this point when this k11 will be energized this contact will be no to nc so the power will be flow dc will be flow through this then the dc will come to this point and this is the closing coil uh, when during the closing operation this all are the nc this uh, obviously nc so this coil will be energized and then this is the negative terminal so circuit is completed for the r phase and it is uh, for the red is indicating the r phase blue is uh, for the uh, yellow phase and black is uh, drawn for the blue phase for your understanding this operations will be same after the uh, after this operations and after the uh, breaker will be on breaker will be on then the auxiliary switches position will be changed the auxiliary switches position will be changed that will be nc that will be nc that will be nc if that will be nc then this circuit um, 75 er la lb lc will be no then you cannot operate or you cannot close the breaker again so anti pumping relay is has been used for 
non uh, it is being used for um, uh, the purpose that you cannot maloperate the baker again and again so this is the closing operations so after the closing operations will be completed this um, p1 la p1 lb and p1 lc are the three uh, counters that will be increased and if this pole this pole and this pole are bring on then this auxiliary contact will be no2 nc no2 nc and no2 nc so this light will be on and this uh, nc contact of the auxiliary contact will be no then the switch will be off and the spring charge case spring charge uh, if the three poles has the spring charge then uh, these contacts are these uh, these three contacts are no to nc now we discussed about the tripping circuit it is very important we have to discuss the tripping circuit all the operation tripping operations and also the closing operations you can operate it from locally or remotely as per your uh, desires or as per your requirements so if you are operating it remotely now what is the k61 k61 is an auxiliary contactor auxiliary contactor here the auxiliary contactor will be uh, energized then that will be you know so if you are pushing the op uh, you have uh, if, if you are want to op the circuit breaker then you have to press this button when you press this button this dc power will come through this point k10 k11 and this all are uh, will be the you know contact uh, all all are the nc contact then the this is the tripping coil for the r phase this is the tripping coil for the y phase and this is the tripping coil for the blue phase and the function is same um, the dc will come from this point and in energize the <coughs> coil and the breaker will be energize the three coils of the three individual poles and the breaker will be off simultaneously the two part here the pre-close and post-close supervision pre-close supervision that means before the closing it, it is checking that the uh, it is checking the circuits that the coil is um, okay or not when the breaker is off in condition then this auxiliary contact will be nc if that will be nc and the voltage is given here voltage is given here and the negative is coming from here you, you, you are getting the path that the um, uh, 195 195 or 295 relay is okay so the coil is okay no problem was there now after the uh, breaker will be on the post close supervision post close supervision what is um, post close supervision so in the post close supervision uh, it is checking that the path is okay or not the breaker is being operated properly all the three pole is same for the trip one this is the trip one and this is the trip two and the in the case of the trip one and trip two both two types of tripping or trip relay is present here this is the individual things for the dc to control circuit here k14 conductor is present here it is the loss of uh, sf6 this b4 is the counters if the all counter is okay then the uh, gas pressure is okay and the uh, positions will be accordingly and this is the spring charging indication if the all the three spring charging indications spring charged then this will be nc and you can operate the circuit breaker accordingly and this is the auto recloser uh, one and this is the auto recloser two this is the pole discrepancy this is the dc supply one and two monitoring purpose and this is the general lockout purpose and the general pressure the normal normal pressures of the breaker is 6 bar 
alarm is 5.2 bar and lockout will be on the 5 bar pressure these are um, uh, the spare nonc contact the 10 10 number no and 10 nc contact for the circuit breaker auxiliary switch per pole and the instructions is given here all auxiliary contacts shown with the circuit de-energized all contacts of the pressure switch shown with the switch in low pressure condition and the contacts of limit switch of the spring switch spring charging motor show with spring discharge condition this is the motor circuits of the three pole individual pole this is for the r pole this is for the y pole and this is for the b pole and this is the illumination circuits and the heating circuit inside the circuit breaker and um, the uh, contactors mcbs points are being used are given accordingly so uh, this is the topic we have discussed today about the siemens make 220 kv circuit breaker and its closing operation tripping operation different types of mcbs different types of contactors used and when the nonc will be converted accordingly um, if you are interested to show my video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more updated technical knowledge and remind your old memories thank you thank you very much for watching my video thank you very much